Hello there, internet friend. How are you today? It's Funky Friday. Funky? No, it's Freedom. Freedom Friday. <laughs> so I did one of these this morning, and it was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. We had a few guests on, or a, a few visitors, viewers viewing, and um, I think we got somebody here. Hello there. My little comment section. I'm not sure if that's working because it's uh, Daniel Ortiz. Yeah, but their tracking software isn't advanced enough for SEM marketing, in my opinion. Daniel. That was actually uh, something that was taking place uh, 340, so it was early. I'm not even sure if that was even today, but greetings. Got the ball rolling with the greetings from Magic Brad. So it's going into the Synergy Collaborative and uh, on Periscope. That's where we're streaming today on two platforms. That's called Synergy and that's called Leverage. So I was going to talk a little bit about um, freedom. And I covered uh, three different types of freedom in the earlier morning version of this Freedom Friday. And those three were time freedom, you know, because we got 24 hours in a day but you don't want to be locked into a space. I have a hard time being stuck in a spot. I need to be able to go when I want to. You know, remember before I was married and I was going to the clubs and stuff like that, and the girls would say, would you watch my purse? Because I want to go dance. Now you're stuck there watching some girl's purse. I hated that. <laughs> you know, I want to be free. So that's one freedom is time freedom. We have the ability to do what you want when you want. And that's really kind of also related to the second freedom, which is mobile freedom, having the ability to move. You know, if you're stuck there watching a girl's purse, you can't go. What if you have to go to the bathroom? What if you want to go upstairs? What if you want to, you know, I like to be able to move. <laughs> Similar kind of thing with marketing. I like to use my phone so that I can do some work. If I have to do work, I can do it from remote. I can go somewhere and use my phone because there's no cords. You know, whereas with the computer, you got cords and stuff. And then uh, the last type of freedom is financial freedom, where you have the ability to scale up your income. And this door swings both ways. You know, your, your income can go down, so you have to be on top of it all. So those are the three types of freedom. But I was going to introduce and share a little bit about a platform that I use called Kartra. And I am an affiliate for Kartra, so if you're interested in utilizing Kartra, then um, if you use my affiliate link, which is on the bottom back bottom of a lot of my pages, then I get a commission from your usage. And as a little bonus, if you do something like that and you do want to use Kartra, and I'll be explaining what Kartra is in a minute, then I'm willing to work with you to learn it because I've been using it for uh, almost a year, I guess. And what it is is basically it's a CRM, which stands for Customer Relationship Management. And it has autoresponders in it so that you can automate and save yourself some time or create some freedom where it will automatically send out emails. It's also got a landing page builder. Oh, I'm going through adolescence. <laughs> It's got a landing page builder in it, so you can create like opt-in pages and video sales pages, and they used to call them squeeze pages, those long ones. And uh, a lot of the pages that I use, I don't use it like a, it, it's much more powerful than the way I'm using it right now. So I was going to share my screen and uh, let you see a little bit about Kartra. So hang on a second and let me uh, see if I can do this. <laughs> And I have to use my phone as a monitor so I can know what the heck I'm doing. You know what I mean? It'll be helpful to me to be able to see what's going down. Share screen, Chrome tab. That's the way I want to do it with my Chrome tab. That makes it much more easier. So I can share Kartra. Now, if all works right, I think you should be able to see my... Uh, screen now in my back office of Kartra. There it is. I'm checking my monitor. And uh, I should be on the side. Do I look like I'm on the side over there? Yes. There I am on the, from here, it's the left-hand side. Okay. 
So this is what Kartra is. This is the back office of Kartra. Um, I used it primarily when I was doing my expos. So here's the tabletop boots and the back wall boots. In this area, you can create products. There's not a lot to see in here, but if you want, I can open one up and give you a peek, see at what it looks like inside there. So if I were to edit the product, it would look like this. So if you've got a online course or if you're selling some kind of digital product or even a physical product, you can utilize this and it has all the different product prices and the payment processing, whether you use PayPal right here or credit card payment. Um, you can put a little picture of the product right there. The second the level is the pricing structure of it. You know, what are you charging for it? When I was doing my trade shows, the booth prices were uh, 597. 600 bucks. And um, just to preface, the reason I'm doing more online marketing like this, when I was doing the events, that was pre COVID. And now this COVID situation happened. And it's just uh, so I need to have something else to rely on because I don't know about the uh, event industry right now. So the next level is the different types of pages, whether they are order pages and thank you pages. And I'll show you the pages in a little bit too and how the checkout form ends up looking like. So there's different elements of the checkout um, where you put a logo on the checkout form and then the different fields that are involved in the checkout form, if you want their name, address, city, state, zip, phone, um, the quantity of them. Uh, you can tag in case someone like they go to the cart and they abandon the cart. There's tracking inside of Kartra so that you can check and see if someone got all the way to the, the, the uh, checkout page, the, the, the uh, cart, and then they left, you can see that. So you can give them a phone call and say, hey, I saw you're looking to buy, but you didn't. Is there a problem? What can I help you with? So there's also terms and conditions and all that kind of stuff. And this is the, the post sale or the, where they, where the, what list they get put into. Again, where you tag them, and then um, how they can get the product. If it's an electronic product or if you're going to mail it, then you can uh, get an address. You can mail a product to them if it's a physical product. Um, Kartra also has the ability to have affiliates. So if you wanted to have a bunch of ambassadors selling for you, you this is a way of compensating them. Um, I've got the booth set up so they can make $150 commissions and $100 commissions. So they're fairly significant. And then the last element of it finishes up and gives you the, ta-da, congratulations, you completed the page. Um, also, it gets into the communications end of it with your, your leads and your lists, and you can tag these different lists so you can keep lists separate. As you can see, I've got multiple lists. I've got Synergy First Thursdays. This is a monthly thing that I used to do. Every, every first Thursday, we used to get together. And I have 94 or 50, 54 people in there. And then I've got my general list. I've got 146 people. Now, just so you know, I've got multiple other lists that are outside of Kartra. I use Kartra for more of my warm and hot leads. So that's why I've got just 146. These are people that have exhibited in the. They're actually paying customers as opposed to prospects. They're more than just leads, they're customers. And then it's got uh, analytics. So if you wanna see how your leads are doing, you can use these analytics and see what they checked into and uh, what they're doing and all that kind of stuff and the kind of money they're spending and blah, 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 blah. You can check the sequences to see how they're going through all the different sequences. See, so I've got multiple sequences. And what, here's what a sequence is. I will show you uh, what a sequence is in here. And we will look at the, the one that I'm kind of proud of is my Synergy's first Thursday one here. Okay, I will do a little edit on that and give you a peek. See at what the Synergy first Thursdays was. And you'll actually see what happened with the whole COVID thing in this scenario also. So I have these all set up with different uh, things that are happening to it. You know, the opt-in form and the, the, the pages and the tagging and the lists and all that kind of stuff. So every 
month because Synergy First Thursdays was a monthly thing. Every month it had an initial, initial greeting. So it's when it's someone opted into a Synergy First Thursday event, you got the initial greeting here. Okay. That would say, hey, how's it going? Thanks for opting in. You'll be getting uh, notifications of each first Thursday. And then the second one that came up here was January. So we, we would do these first Thursdays at different places in the Twin Cities, like Pinstripes and Punchbowl Social, or we'd go over to uh, Kipps Irish Pub and Network, or we'd go to um, Top Golf or uh, iFly or places, different, different activities, do things on the boats and things like that. And we would get together and do some socializing and networking. So this hit them on the, uh, the early part of January and let them know, hey, don't forget, first Thursday is coming up, so a little reminder. And this automates everything for me. So then when February comes along, here's the one for February. And when March comes along, here's the one for March. And when April comes along, here comes the one from April. And here's the one that's scheduled for May. So I had this preset. And if you remember, the COVID came in around the March time. And that's when, yeah, everything kind of shut down. And I quit doing first Thursdays because the venues had to close down. That's when I made my pivot towards affiliate marketing. So let me show you some other things in the, uh, in the, Kartra platform, I will show you the pages that can be done with uh, this. So this is um, one of my, here's the one from my Magic Brad show that I do. Let me open that one up for you and give you a little see of what that looks like. So within Kartra here, you can drop in different graphics and things. Come on, come on, hurry up, hurry up. You drop in little graphics and images and opt-in forms. And sometimes when there's a lot of stuff, it takes a little time here. So there it is. Do, 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 do. There it is. So that's the little graphic that I had of the show. And then there's these little text things in here and you can, you can change the text. More pictures of me. I've got this hooked up with, uh, this goes to a scheduler. So you can schedule a time on the show. And then I've got different packages. I've got my free interviews that I do with people. Then I've got a basic package where I do some advertising and marketing for the interview to generate leads. And that's a hundred bucks. And then I, there's a little buy now button there that get, gives them the ability to pay for it. And I've got a bigger package that involves more as far as the uh, lead generation. That's 297, same kind of thing. Then there's a little opt-in form if they want to get on my list right here. And this asks for their email address, their name, and their uh, phone number. And the phone number I made optional because sometimes people don't like to give out phone numbers. And then here's some samples of past videos. So you just embed the videos there. They can take a peek at them and da-da-da-da-da. And if you notice on the bottom of all these pages, I've got this Kartra link. This is my affiliate link that allows people to come in here and uh, buy the Kartra platform. And then I earn a commission off that. So that's uh, that. Let me get out of this. Okay. I'm going to show you another one that I've got. You know what, I'm gonna go on to the actual, it takes too long to open it up. I'm gonna go on to the actual uh, page online and see if I can do that. See if I, it gives me the ability to share on a different, uh, does it allow me to do that? See? I'm, these things are changing, and you, you always learn new stuff from these things. Share screen, Chrome tab, Magic Brad, share. Dun, dun, dun. So that's what that looks like. So big and bold is the logo, and as you scroll down, you can see the different uh, events. I'm doing a, a collaborative thing with a friend of mine. We've got this uh, 
Marketing Monday, the next one's coming up here on August 31st. We already did these. And then here I've got a lot of different affiliate offers that I represent. I promote all these offers and when, when sales get made, then I earn commissions off it. And here's a little header for the uh, Magic Brad show. And there's the opt-in form to capture leads. And of course the little, the Kartra option. So, da da. So, there you go, Kokomo. That's how that works with Kartra. And again, if you have any questions on it and you want to learn about it or you want to get on and do a screen share and if you want to learn about it, it's similar to a program that you probably have heard of perhaps called ClickFunnels. There's another one called uh, Lead Pages. I like Kartra. It, seem, it seems to work a little bit better for me. I like it. So that's uh, the essence of Kartra. And I've gone on here for 16 minutes. So I'll spend another five, four or five minutes with you. I don't like to do my videos very long because it can be very time consuming. And I like to just get right to the point on these things. Um, so that's Freedom Friday. Using software like this, it automates a lot of time. You put time into the building the page up and you set up all those sequences and those automations. And then it's just a matter of driving people to the page. They opt into the page and they get into a list and then they start getting automated emails that uh, send them to different areas. And it's very interesting because you can set up automations where if someone clicks on this, it will take them out of this list and put them into another list. So if you've got somebody that, um, you know, they, they've made a, a buy, they've made a purchasing decision and they bought one of your products, you don't want to continue to sell this, send them emails on that same product. So it takes them out of that list and puts them into another list that talks more about something that's more relevant. So automation, I think, is a very interesting thing. But there's some downsides to it is you got to kind of monitor. Otherwise, and you probably get that kind of stuff like this is not even relevant to me. Why am I getting this email? So you got to be on top of it. Make sure that that stuff is all set up that way. That's why a lot of the stuff that I do is more evergreen and generic. So when I'm doing things like as an example with my event planner expo, a constant with it is it's always the first week in March. But every year that changes. This last, this in 2020, it was March 4th. In 2021, it's March 3rd. So I don't put the full date and time in it because that might change. I just say coming in March. You see what I'm saying? And that way those emails are still relevant because it is going to come in March. However, the COVID thing happens. So it might end up being a virtual event this year. Aside from that, a lot of what I'm doing now is affiliate marketing where I promote a product and earn a commission off it. A lot of these things are membership type programs. And the reason I like membership programs is they are recurring. So there's recurring commissions on the memberships. Same thing with some of these pieces of software, like with Kartra. That's about 97 bucks a month. I think I get 40 bucks, 40 bucks a month when I promote the Kartra out to other people. There's also uh, another platform I represent that's called NowSite. NowSite, it's uh, two different things, and they're, they're at different price points. There's NowSite Marketing that uses a lot of automation, and it's three-click marketing, which is not really three clicks. It's actually six clicks because you have to click it once to send stuff to Facebook, and then you click it again to confirm that you did so. And then you click it again and it goes to your blog and you click it again to confirm you did so. Then you click it again and send it to your email list and you click it again to say I did so. So it is really six clicks, but they call it three click marketing. And it's pretty cool because it just happens in the morning. I just uh, shoot that out with those three little clicks and then those things go out on the internet and then people opt in there and it builds your list. And then those get into automated sequences that continually send information for these different programs that I'm promoting, like Referizer and Kartra and Easy One Up and, and uh, Sales Vision and uh, NowSite. And there's uh, a plethora of different products and services that you can offer. 
anyways, that's about all I got for you now. So I appreciate you tuning in to themagicbradshow.com. And I appreciate you tuning in for, what was it called? We called it Freedom Friday. Dun, 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 dun. Let's give myself a round of applause. Thank you very much. So this is kind of fun doing these uh, video Zoom StreamYard platform things, but I'm looking forward to being able to get together with people at networking events and having coffee and going out on the boats again and going to pinstripes and playing games and all that kind of stuff. But until then, this is what we're going to do. So peace, love, and happiness. Be safe. Be kind. Be nice. Don't protest. Just relax. Chill out. and. Uh, it's all good. <laughs> and remember, there's a curfew. Don't be out after dark. Okay? See ya. Bye. Peace.